Hello everyone and welcome to the channel. Have you ever wondered how Star Trek's Vulcan Nerf Wrench came to be? Or how much money Bob Ross made from his long-running painting show The Joy of Painting? We'll find that out and more! Get ready to be mind blown by these unbelievable facts that will leave you speechless. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Now, on to the facts! Here are 30 random facts to make your day. Although the name Big Ben is often used to refer to the bell tower of the Palace of Westminster, the tower itself is actually the Elizabeth Tower. Big Ben is the nickname of the bell inside. A jog around the bases of a baseball diamond is the same distance as a jog across a football field. The game of rock, paper, scissors is a long-lived one. The game dates all the way back to the time of the Chinese Han Dynasty, 206 BC to 220 AD. Cunningham's Law, named after the inventor of the wiki, Ward Cunningham, states that the best way to get the right answer on the internet is not to ask a question, but to post a wrong answer. Hmm, should I have said it was named after Richie Cunningham? For those that don't know, that's a Happy Days reference. Now let's continue. Looking for a clever palindromic name for your cat? Taco Cat is Taco Cat spelled backwards. Pam Cooking Spray, introduced in the early 1960s, wasn't named after a woman named Pam. It was an acronym for the inventor, product of Arthur Meyerhoff. Sting sings backup vocals on the Dire Straits hit single, Money for Nothing. You can hear him very clearly at the beginning and end of the song, singing in falsetto, I want my, I want my, I want my MTV. Okay, fine, I won't give up my day job. If all of the salt were removed from the oceans and spread evenly over the Earth's land surface, it would form a layer more than 166 meters thick. In ancient Greece, they believed redheads became vampires after death. This was partly because redheaded people are very pale skinned and sensitive to sunlight, unlike the Mediterranean Greeks, who had olive skin and dark features. The University of Oxford is older than the Aztec Empire. The University of Oxford first opened its doors to students all the way back in 1096. By comparison, the Aztec Empire is said to have originated with the founding of the city of Tenochtitlan at Lake Texcoco by the Mexica, which occurred in the year 1325. William Phillips Eno invented the stop sign, the pedestrian crosswalk, the one-way street, the traffic circle, and many other elements of the modern automotive landscape. But, ironically, he never learned to drive. Tablecloths were originally designed to be used as one big communal napkin. When they were first invented, guests were meant to wipe off their hands and faces on a tablecloth after a messy dinner party. Although the rings of Saturn extend outwards nearly 80,000 kilometers from Saturn's equatorial line, they're remarkably skinny. The rings range in thickness from approximately 10 meters to about 1 kilometer thick. Iconic Times Square in New York City was originally called Longacre Square until New York Times publisher Adolf S. Ox convinced the mayor of New York to rename it. The Vulcan nerve pinch was improvised by Leonard Nimoy when a Star Trek script called for him to punch someone. Nimoy thought a Vulcan wouldn't just slug someone in the face, and created the maneuver to allow Spock to subdue someone without a punch. An average cumulus cloud weighs, due to the water suspended within, a staggering 500,000 kilograms, with storm clouds weighing even more. However, the air below it is even heavier, so the lesser density of the cloud allows it to float on the drier and more dense air. Fred Rogers composed nearly all of the music featured on his long-running show, Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. When you lose weight, the byproduct of the fat loss is removed from your body as gases and liquids. For every 10 kilograms of fat you lose, 8.4 kilograms is released from your body via exhaled carbon dioxide, and 1.6 kilograms is released as water via sweating, urination, and other excretions, 
No, excuse me, I gotta go pee. Before roasting, raw or green coffee beans have little to no flavor and a grassy smell. The orange is a hybrid fruit, and researchers have learned that the original orange was a hybrid of a pomelo, citrus maxima, and a mandarin, citrus reticulata. If you want to recreate the entire Lego movie brick for brick, you better get your checkbook ready. You'll need 15,080,330 Lego pieces. The U of State of Delaware has the fewest number of counties of any state, a mere three, Kent, Newcastle, and Sussex. Ferrets, dogs, and monkeys were the most popular pets in the Roman Empire. Instead of cats, ancient Romans used ferrets to hunt mice and rats. They used dogs as guards and monkeys as entertainment. Black boxes, flight recorders used to investigate aviation accidents and incidents, aren't actually black, but are painted bright orange to aid in visual identification during recovery efforts. Harry Selfridge pioneered the practice of placing perfume counters at the front of department stores. He did so both to entice customers to buy it and to mask the smell of manure and exhaust fumes from the street outside. Breast milk contains varying degrees of melatonin based on the time of day. The melatonin content helps the baby regulate a sleep cycle and reduces incidence of colic. Bob Ross filmed The Joy of Painting, a long-running art show featured on PBS, for free. He made all his money via art supplies and art lessons. The name of the American rock band Ario Speedwagon isn't just a fanciful name. The band was named after the early 20th century ancestor of the modern pickup truck, the Ario Speedwagon. The deepest point in the Mediterranean Sea is the Calypso Deep, located southwest of Pylos, Greece, with a maximum depth of 5,267 meters. The extreme depth can be attributed to the subduction of the African plate sliding under the Asian Sea Plate, which creates the Hellenic Trench. Given how many vast deserts there are on Earth, it seems strange to think that we're running low on sand for construction applications, but desert sand grains are predominantly eroded by wind, making them too fine and not as suitable for certain construction projects as more angular water-eroded sands. There we have it, 30 fascinating facts to make your day. What facts surprised you the most? Let us know in the comments below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, Check out some of our other videos and subscribe for more fascinating content. Until next time, stay curious and you have a great day.